What's up guys, Boston Bass Company, Wicked Bass, probably the last episode of this uh, season two. Uh, maybe I can sneak a few more in, but uh, it's probably episode four, so I'm trying to shoot for like, you know, four season. Uh, do a couple seasons a year, but uh, today it's, uh, let's see, what was it? 50 degrees is a high, but uh, right now I think it's like 46, it's getting late. Uh, hopefully I can snag a few. Today I'm going to be throwing the uh, the S waiver. It's only like my second week throwing swim baits. Um, so I've fished with about maybe like four or five times. The triple trout. Triple trout right now is my, my go-to uh, lure, actually. Um, believe it or not. But uh, since the fall bite is almost over, the fish are slowing down. So I'm going to use the glide bait and uh, see if I can pull a few out with that slow and steady. Um, I have no clue how to fish a glide bait, so bear with me. Um, my first time ever throwing it, so uh, hopefully I can get a few. My reel is a little bit fast. I'm using a speed spool, which is not, I don't know if it's good or not. I have no clue what I'm talking about, right? Um, but it's probably going to reel it in a bit too fast, so I'm going to have to change up my cadence on it. Uh, so I'll let me know what I'm doing right, what I'm doing wrong, but uh, hopefully I get a few in the glide bait. Uh, I'm going to throw a spinner bait a little bit. Uh, one of the viewers requested throwing a spinner bait for this fall bite, but I think the fall bite is too late that that spinner bait is not going to entice a bite. Just think it's too fast moving. And I didn't bring all my spinner baits. I've only got a couple larger profile spinner baits. But uh, let's see what we can get to. All right. Maybe today, maybe today is the day of the PB. I don't know. Glide baits, maybe. I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about, but. Last episode of the year. Maybe I catch my PB. Maybe I don't. That'd be pretty friggin' sweet. But uh, there's some running water over here, so I'm gonna fish this tree, uh, this little part of the river, and then uh, work my way down and back up to here. Um, see if I can pull a few hogs out for you. All right, tight lines. <gasps> no! Oh, wow, he destroyed that jig. Yep. Oh god, I got my first glider fish. Holy crap. What? 
I was not ready for that. I'm s- What the heck? Am I recording? <laughs> I hope I'm recording. <laughs> what just happened, dude? I just messed this up. All up. I'm definitely recording for that. My first S waiver bass ever. Wow, that's pretty freaking sweet. And he absolutely just crushed it. It's actually a pretty fat bass. Look at that, boys. S waiver. Not bad, guys. Solid two and a half pounder, maybe. Good bass. Good fish. Good fish on the S waiver. My first glide bait fish ever. And I was turning the boat and I, my line just got absolutely crushed. So, oh, this could be a good video already. I can't believe it, guys. Oh, dude, you got me wet. Bro, I'm soaked. Well, okay, so on that cast, now I'm caught in my freaking. Let me get me out of here. Boys, oh, let me. I am. Okay, so this is the S waiver 168 or 170 or whatever the hell they call it. I don't know. Whatever, I'm just out here throwing it for my first time. No clue what I'm doing. I'm not even gonna lie. I have no clue how I'm down watching videos on how to fish it. And I'm just, just kind of doing this. And it got absolutely crushed. I could not believe it. So, man, I'm not even act like I know what I'm doing, but. <sighs> that was my first glide bait fish ever. He was just on there. I don't know if you guys can see what I'm, I'm fishing right now, but I'm gonna make my way around this little pond part of, uh, of the river. The river just continues right through here to that bridge I just showed you to the right. Um, it's pretty shallow all around this pond, except uh, right there is a deer crossing right ahead. And right up there, uh, goes down to like one foot deep, and then right after it just drops off to like 18 feet. Cut a couple fish out of there, but. I think if I just glide this bait right over the top of them, they might just whack it. I hope. So we're gonna fish this, we're gonna do a whole loop around here. Then we're gonna go down to the faster moving part of the river. Fish this spot with glide baits. Don't really know how to fish a glide bait in the, uh, in like a fast moving current. Leftover weeds are. I had to put my winter coat on, guys, because I'm a Nancy and I'm cold. I'd rather be comfortable when I'm fishing, not freezing. Boy, I can't wait to the pre spawn. I'll be out here March 1st. Take November. And pretty much December, January. February, so three months. Let's take it easy on the fishing. Read up.
Oh, got pegged. Good bass. Oh, yes. And he fell off. Oh, oh that's a solid three pounder. <gasps> you always see that? Persistence pays off. Holy crap. Solid chunk. He's got a lot of energy. Holy crap. Four, four, five, six, that's my PB. I just caught my PB on a glide bait. Four, five, six. Boy! <laughs> oh, I couldn't be any more happy right now. That bad boy. Huge bass. Well, boys and girls. Here goes my PB. Four pounds, four and a half pounds. Wow. Wow, what's up? Just caught that bad boy on the S waiver. See if he bent my hooks out. Nope, we are good. Yes. I cannot believe I just caught my PB. Just gliding this S waiver back and he just absolutely munched it and it fell off of the net. I'm so pumped right now, I feel like a little kid. I am a little kid, it's okay, all right. Oh boy. First day using the glide bait, what's up? Yes. Before guys, my PB was three pound, 3.96 on that scale. I cannot believe it. All right, guys, that's it for today. Um, today uh, wasn't my most productive day, but it's late fall fishing. So I uh, said I caught my uh, my PB off of the S waiver, 168, on my 7.9 uh, medium, medium heavy uh, Dobbins with my loose, loose speed spool. Terrible combination, but hey, it works. It worked for me today. Um, could use a little bit of slower reel to slow down my retrieve, but I mean, hey, I caught my PB, so I really don't even care. Uh, what a way to end the season. Like, I really can't believe I just caught my PB. Kind of stinks that uh, my partner Andrew wasn't here to share the moment with me. You know, it's good, you know, get a good couple good pictures. You know, I didn't get any really good pictures. Kind of stinks when you catch a PB and can't get a picture, but. Uh, but that's pretty much it. Uh, gonna head back, head back now, and uh, call it a day. Get picked up. Let's see, uh, 11. What time did I get here? 11 something to 3:30. So about four hours of fishing. Not bad. Just gonna pick up the boat and. Uh, Head in. I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this video. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button and hit that little bell so that way you guys can uh, get a notification when we uh, upload our next video. Um, looking forward to doing some ice fishing this year, so stay tuned for some, some good stuff and uh, some reviews and uh, all that good stuff. Alright, so, uh, thanks guys.